it going everybody? Sean here, back with another video, and today was supposed to be a lot more exciting than what this video is going to be. Sorry to burst your bubble if you were looking for this exquisite video of uh, a botanical garden, which I was supposed to do, and some beautiful landscapes, which was supposed to be in there too, some epic b-roll of today. <clears throat> Boy, was it supposed to be good, but uh, yeah, weather had other plans. It uh, did not turn out that way. It was raining, pouring. Old man was definitely snoring on that one. Yeah, we got wet. Yeah, we got soaked. Uh, it was a great time. Uh, we, did, we, we weren't there very long though, because yeah, it just rained. The one time I had a chance to film something for this vlog and it just never happened. Ah, oh, so sad. Anyway, way off topic here, but instead we are here in my homemade studio and now we are going to have an even better time on this vlog and uh, yeah, you guys will enjoy it and I will enjoy making it. Alrighty, it is September 26th. Yes, this vlog challenge I didn't hear about for some reason and I follow a lot of uh, videographers and content creators on YouTube. I don't know how I never heard about this till last week and I don't have and I haven't had time to make anything between last week and today. So I'm here going to be talking to you guys and then right after this editing it and phew, right on YouTube. That's it. That's all it is. You know what? Sometimes you just have to do what you got to do, right? That's just the way it is. It's just how life works. Sometimes you just have to dig down deep and just do it again i just went way off topic here back on track so what this video is going to be about is going to be about taking you through my story on how i got started with videography how i got started with photography what i'm passionate about when it comes to that creative part or that creative side what my goals are for this channel and how i keep improving myself every single time i go out to either create videos edit videos or even edit and take my photos. So without further ado, let's dive in, shall we? First one, how did I get started? You might ask, probably not, but let's say you do. Well, let's see. It all started at this point now, back in May of just this year, I was scrolling around the old YouTube, you know, going down the old rabbit hole that YouTube sends you on and boom. There was the video, how to make your phone take cinematic video or look cinematic, something like that, somewhere along those lines. Content creator was Learn Online Video. You guys probably know him, fantastic channel. I recommend him. Anyway, off topic again. So I saw that video and I was just like, mind blown. I was just like, what? That's amazing. Right after that, literally something just went and was just like, oh. Let's try it out. Right then and there, that's when I actually took like my first video. All it was was me, video my dog, panning sideways, hitting that background, and then transitioning into that, from that same background onto my dog again. The transition wasn't the best, but it was my first video. And I was just like, that's awesome that you can do this just with your phone. And then from there, it was just video after video after video on what I can do to improve my video making, to improve what it is I'm doing. Here we are. Where did photography come from? Well, photography just kind of rolled in. I can't even tell you where because it was just, it just, it just manifested itself. And photography is just something now that has just become, it's not a main focus. Video is no longer a main focus. It's like both are just that type of, they just give me that high. Whenever I go out, a camera comes with me, my gimbal comes with me because it's just something that's like, okay, I'm going out, no matter where I go, something might pop up that I might have to take a picture of or will need to take a picture of or vice versa, I might have to, like something, like a video will have to be taken. It's just like, ugh. as you can see, it's just so exciting. It's, you just get excited. You guys probably know that. You just, yeah, no words to describe that, right? I got really lucky because my father-in-law gave my wife his Sony A200 camera. She put it away and never used it. And like I said, something just clicked one day and I picked it up 
and ever since I have yet to be able to put it down. All the pictures that I take and are on my Instagram right now are from this camera. That is how my journey of video and photography started from that one video to where I am now, it was just, yeah, something clicked, I'm happier for it. I feel like that was a good description on, on uh, how I got started. Now we're gonna be getting into what I love to do as a creator, as a creative, and what I love to film, and what I love to take pictures of. When I go out, it's all about location. I've done locations here in Nova Scotia from Annapolis Royal, Morden, Port George, Margaretville, and I got a bunch of other locations that I have planned right now. My goal with those videos is if somebody wants to travel to Nova Scotia for some whatever reason for travel and they search up, oh, what's in Nova Scotia? What's a good place? I want my video to be that video that makes that person go to that place. That right there is what gets me going. It allows me to keep going and keep making those videos. At the same time, I've gotten more into the vlogging as well. So I'm vlogging myself doing these videos. So I've got two right now. I've got Port George, the Annapolis Royal video. I'm there vlogging, but at the same time, I'm there creating the location video. That is like my first step into vlogging. Now at the same time, I'm trying to broaden my horizon in terms of just tutorials and how to better edit your videos, better edit your pictures and all that jazz to help others get better at creating videos and editing their pictures themselves because that was a huge reason on how I've gotten better. The amount of videos, the amount of time that I have put in these last four months into photography, into video, broadening my horizon is huge. All thanks to people posting on YouTube, Skillshare, and all that kind of stuff. That is what I want to be posting. That is what I love to do. That is what I'm passionate about. When it comes to photography, it's landscape. I don't know what it is when it comes to landscaping. Landscape photography, it just doesn't move. The land is there. It doesn't move. I don't have to say, hey, you, stay still. No, dog. You, don't move. Don't look away. Look over here. Look at me. Yeah, landscapes don't move. That's what I'm passionate about. I'm actually, next week, my first time doing a couple's photography of one of my buddies from work. It's just free work. He'll let me take their photos, but at the same time, they're allowing me to use those on my Instagram to almost like build up my portfolio. So that right there, awesome. Trying to branch out there as well to broaden my horizon into photography as well. Bang on. So moving on to the next one, which is what I do to keep on improving. I've got a rule. When it comes to making my videos, I've got to do different movements. So I, whether it be like a push forward, a push backwards, you know, a slide right, slide left, anything when it comes to creating that video in camera transition instead of just using the transitions that the uh, program has, any little thing like that, I have to input at least one. When it comes to editing, I have to try to put in at least one different effect that I haven't done in my other videos. That way, my videos, every single one is different, it doesn't look so amateurish. So that is my golden rule when it comes to editing and creating my videos that way. When it comes to photography, different angles, different settings on my camera, making sure that, you know, I always use manual, making sure I try different shutter speeds, different aperture ISOs I play around here and there. But, and when it comes to editing, I have, I've edited so much that I have now found my style. So that right there is a bonus as well, right? Can't complain there. I've got, I got so much to learn though. But that's how you get better, right? You never want to stop learning. Right? Moving on to what I would love to achieve with this channel. I would love to obviously get more subscribers, but I just want to be able to reach out to more people, either to educate them on different effects, how to edit their videos, how to edit their pictures. That is all I would want to do with this channel. Subscribers, likes, as much as it's something that you, as a content creator, as a YouTuber, just mm, strive for and, 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 and are like, why aren't you working? You know, it'll come. That's all I got to keep, that's all I keep telling myself is just keep on going, don't quit, just put out the next video, make the next video, post every day on Instagram, and someday, one day, it might not happen, but one day you will get to a thousand subscribers, we'll get to 10,000, and so on and so forth. What I tell myself, is that this is not my full-time job. That is something that I have to keep reminding myself. I have a full-time job. I have other responsibilities that I have to do. Every video is getting better. Every video I'm learning. Every picture that I take 
I'm learning so much more on how to use the camera. I'm just so happy of where I am right now that I wouldn't even change it. Because eventually it will come. Just keep taking those strides. Keep taking and learning. So thank you very much for watching this. I hope I've been able to convey my message, been able to tell you my passion, how I got started, and just where I am right now. Right now is just, mm, man, I keep making funny noises. So happy. Well, anyway, that is the end of this vlog. Studio style, if you even call it that type of vlog. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure if I can say the hit that like, hit that subscribe button at any point in this type of challenge, but I hope this video was good. Great? Yeah. Hope this video was great. Hope you guys enjoyed it. All right, guys. My name's Sean. Have yourselves a wonderful day. Peace.